We're here at 1635 Kitty Mall Drive in Virginia Beach. Nice little palm tree right in front. Thank you. Definitely realize it's summer right now, at least here. Uh, this video is shot May 2nd, 2015. And as we come in, you can see actually the blinds are closed, but when they are open, there's actually quite a bit of light in here. I was trying to eliminate uh, any glare, but uh, quite a bit of light as you can see, a very nice uh, front door as we come in here. Uh, and then there's a little step down as well. We'll kind of back up so you guys can see. So you have tile right in the entrance when you come in, and then you have this really nice flooring right in here. A lot of, a lot of really well uh, lit areas. I mean, I think they cover pretty much everything so far as the lighting that can be a, a problematic sometimes in some of the houses in Virginia Beach, but each one of the rooms have it as well. As you can see the crown molding up top as well. A little storage space under the staircase, good utilization of that. Uh, right as you come in here, you do have, as you can see, the tile continues. Uh, and that kind of goes back so you can take advantage of as much space as possible. Uh, there is a light in there as well, just so you guys know. Um, washer and dryer will convey. You have plenty of space up top to set anything up there, all your detergents and whatnot. As you come in here, um, you have a really nice uh, bathroom. Wayne's coating, I believe is what that's called. Sorry, I could not think of the name of that, uh, but just down there as well. Uh, and coming in, just into the main area uh, where the kitchen, all the, all the magic happens, at least in my house, uh, you have a uh, nice little dining area, kind of living uh, room as well. You can kind of go either or, whichever you prefer, uh, but you definitely have that as an option as well. Nice ceiling fan as well, uh, up above, in case you guys are eating some spicy food or something like that, keep it cooled down. Uh, over here, I really like this uh, countertop that they have in place, a little unique. I like it uh, a little different, but it definitely works. And over here, you could utilize this space, obviously, as kind of your, your sit-in dining area. And we'll take a quick look out here. As you can see, right there, and you can see the water, uh, which we'll get to momentarily. Uh, but I didn't want you guys to take a look at that. So you do have a, a nice gas stove over here as well. Nice big refrigerator. Um, newer stainless steel um, uh, microwave and, and uh, dishwasher there as well, but I like it. You know, the chef can kind of go either way, keep in touch with somebody just down the hallway here or right to the left uh, without disturbing anybody. So kind of neat. I like the way it's set up there. And again, there your wood burning fireplace right there. Uh, and actually, let me back up two seconds. They have the neat little blinds that you can turn and, you know, they come up at the bottom there and they're in the window. I think that's always a cool feature. Anywho, you have a storm door here as you head out. You do have one storage closet. And then in addition to that, you still have your shed over here and a little box to kind of keep everything that you need. So any uh, lawn equipment or anything like that, you'll definitely have access to that. And as you walk down here, uh, it's not directly on the water per se. It's not like you walk out of the fence and you're right there. You actually even do like a game of cornhole or something out here or some... Uh, some horseshoe, but you do have a nice little thing of water here. You see the ducks across the way, maybe. Not sure if you guys can see those, but uh, they'll hang out here, maybe feed the ducks or something. But uh, definitely really relaxing to be able to enjoy this uh, nice little view out here. Just enjoy being on the water there. It makes things a little bit more peaceful in my mind. So you have a patio as we come back over here. Nice little patio so you can just kind of relax. And as you can see right there, I'm just wiping my feet, but you do have that uh, outlet right there as well. Uh, so if anybody needs to plug anything in, uh, having an outdoor outlet is always a nice thing as well. As we come back inside, continue to wipe my feet. It's been a little rainy in Virginia Beach, but uh, we'll come over here. And you do have that remote for that ceiling fan up above. And just to my right, you do have an alarm system. So it is wired for that too. Uh, I always think that's a good thing to just know. don't have to necessarily utilize it, but um, it is wired if that's a, something you guys want to take advantage of. So... Heading upstairs, we have a little linen closet. Um, if you need to store anything, all the towels and whatnot, you can. Coming over here into the master bedroom, excuse me, uh, you do have one closet, a second closet in here, and then I'll give you guys a big perspective of the room so you can see just how big it is. And coming right over here, I really like what they've done. Um, this is actually pretty neat. They have a really nice vanity in here, nice lighting, uh, newer toilet, and this whole bathroom had been re uh, renovated uh, just recently. So love the tile work in here. And as you can see, this shower door right here, 
uh, kind of somewhat see-through, but uh, not quite. So you still have that uh, that uh, illusion that they're in here. You guys get what I'm trying to say. We'll head back over here and take a look. Directly above me, by the way, attic space. Um, so that's definitely good. You can store some holiday supplies up in there. Right over here, you can see very nice, good space. Pretty good sized room, especially for Virginia Beach. Uh, sometimes they're notorious for having very, very small rooms. It's actually pretty good size. Then you do have a good sized closet in there. The sliding one, I like that. I always like the sliding glass doors. Uh, coming in here, this is actually a huge vanity. I hope you guys can see that. So there's plenty of space to store anything. It's a newer one. You have that neat lighting directly above. And again, they have really nice tile work done all the way up to the ceiling in the shower. So really, really well done. Uh, and I like the little individual tiles down there at the bottom too. And you even have that little rack right in the middle to, to hang stuff up. So pretty neat. Very well done. That'll about wrap it up for 1635 Kitty Mall Drive. Come fill out an application now.